ways to start an InCopy lead project. The most common is the design initiated workflow. The manuscript is typeset by the designer using InDesign. They can link all of the text to InCopy and let editorial know that first pages are available on the central server. I have a document here with some simple styling included on an unused master page. The designer will place the manuscript into InDesign. Tick Show Import Options as you import the text and this dialog box will appear. I like to replace the incoming styles with my own InDesign styles where possible. Word and other word processing programs tend to bring with them a lot of irrelevant formatting data, so it's best practice to replace the incoming styles with clean InDesign styles. Once the document is placed, the designer will have to manually go through and remove style overrides and compare the character style to the original manuscript. If the italics, for example, were styled using a quick command rather than a character style, they will get lost in the transfer. Once the designer has typeset the book, they can simply select the layer, the text is on, and link that to InCopy. The InDesign file is now ready to be viewed and edited by the editorial team. Whether the designer or the author has initiated the workflow, the designer's InDesign files are what the workflow centers around. Once the designer has typeset the book, it is now ready for the editorial team to get in there and start editing. The designer can open up the InDesign document and will be warned that the links have been updated. The first few times you do this, I recommend not automatically updating them, but manually going through to see what changes have come through. Any notes that have come through appear as a little triangle in the text, but also in a handy palette so you can scroll through them quickly. Once addressed, you can simply delete or respond so editorial can read them later on. The designer can check in and out any text boxes that need attention, just like the editors can in InCopy. Once happy, the designer can notify editorial that the next set of proofs are ready for viewing. Better yet, they can create a press-ready PDF for final check by both design and editorial. Once the final design has been signed off and press-ready PDFs or PDFX files have been created, I like to unlink my InCopy assignments. There are two really quick ways to unlink InCopy assignments. The text will return to normal static text. If in the future you want to relink the content to InCopy, simply use Edit, InCopy, Assign Layer to InCopy, and all the text on that layer will be editable again. Easy peasy. InCopy is the ultimate collaboration tool for designers and editors. Thanks so much for taking the time to watch this video. Let me know in the comments below if you want a more in-depth look at how to use InCopy as an author or as a designer. Please like, subscribe and share.